M0 FXB Hamtech, welcome to my channel. Let's configure the Kenwood D75 to work with the DV Connect by PA7 LIM. And big thank you for this app. First thing you want to do is go to the Play Store and download the app. It looks like that, and just tap it. It's a free download and open that. Next thing is to pair the Bluetooth on our two devices. So swipe down like so. Turn on the Bluetooth, then hold your finger on it. And you wanna go, it's scanning already. Then we go to menu on the D75, menu. Go across to the cog, this one here. Enter, go to Bluetooth, enter and turn it on by pressing enter and then select on, you can do it with the toggle on. Then go down and always use, anything you use on this radio, pairing mode and you get a 60 second countdown and it will appear on this screen be patient but it will appear there you go there it is there tap it and you'll get messages on both devices click ok and click pair and we're now paired and it will say pairing complete so we're all paired next thing is to go menu back out first click ok go menu and then go up to the star, press enter, and you wanna go down to DV Gateway. Enter. DV Gateway is already on, but we're gonna, it will be off, so let's turn it off. And then start just to show you again. Menu, star, DV Gateway, enter, and then turn it on your reflector terminal mode, which is what this is, enter. Okay, then the next one we want to do is go menu here, up down to the cog, enter, and go down to interface, interface, enter. Go to the bottom, and on DV Gateway, you need to make sure it says Bluetooth because you have two choices USB or Bluetooth. We're going to go Bluetooth, okay? Then go menu to come out. So we're now in terminal mode and we're gonna be communicating via Bluetooth. We've paired the two devices. So now we just turn it on with the red button, but let's just check the cog first, hit the cog and make sure we've got our call sign in there. I don't think the frequency matters at the moment. If it does, we'll let you know, but I don't think it matters right now. And look, select the device, which is the THD75 and then red button here, turn it on. And you get a message here saying Bluetooth connected. I know it's fast. Turn it off. Turn it back on. We get there. Connected Bluetooth device. Now we can either choose using the radio or the screen. So we'll do the screen first and then we'll try and change with the radio. So we're going to just select. You, you can have favorites, but we're going to go reflector. Um, do the, the usual one. One Charlie. And we're going to hit connect. We'll turn the volume up on the radio. Connect. Straight away, it's busy. And yeah, everyone's using their D seventy fives. Yeah, I know. I, I, I have a friend who has a uh, he's an old three D printer at home, so he make a lot of things. Yeah, he's trying like to make. It's very convenient. It sounds great, doesn't it? Now, if we disconnect. Go to a quieter one, just go to reflector 10, and then connect, see if that connects in. So it's quiet now, yeah? What we're gonna try and do. F zero one zero C. We're gonna try and move using the radio. So we're gonna hold it up, up arrow, reflector, link to reflector. And we've already selected one Charlie. Let's do a new one. We're going to go input, which is the AB button here. And we can choose DCS, XLX, reflectors. So if I go XLX 477, which is hub net. 77, seven. let's try it. And I think it's BL on that one. Enter. And then key. It should switch us to Hubnet. Going to XL, X4, 7, 7, B. But you can see it's worked using the radio. Now to talk, you need to push it upwards. 
and go to reflector and then use reflector and then we can just grab the radio and go m 0 sxb test 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 anyone receiving me and you can see that when i transmit it goes green and hopefully when someone talks it will go red if anyone's there no nope. let me just try my hubnet node was the one with the radio there you go there's someone there i'm just going to quickly grab the radio and reply and see if they hear me gw1 station you receiving me m0 fxb m0 fxb and that's actually an analog connection in my house but we're using d star or the D Star system to get through to these people. What I'll try and do is come in on my um on my analog radio. Let's give it a go. If I'm quick enough. M0 FXB, how are you receiving me now? You receiving me okay now? I'm actually using my D74 for this. people testing there yeah hi Roy it's M0 FXB Andreas in Western Supermare Mike Zero Foxtrot X-Ray Bravo receiving you loud and clear and it looks like he's coming through via DMR and the call sign you'll see in the M0 H something in a second you'll see it okay, Zero. that's actually a DV that's actually a gateway if I turn that down, turn up, that's the 75 now via D Star. It's a bit jumpy there. So I finished my chat with Roy. Thanks for watching. And then more tests soon, but it's working excellent. Thanks very much to PA7LIM, David. 7-3, all the best.